PS81, welcome to week two of remote learning. I know you miss school, we miss all of you, and hopefully this is keeping you active at home and not driving everybody crazy. So remember, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can check this out, obviously, on Facebook, but you can also go to the website and see all of this. Week two, I did it differently this week. This is for grades kindergarten and first. So step one, you're gonna download this sheet or make your own. It is a mini mileage log. We're gonna see how many miles we can get in being at home. Step two, we're gonna review these exercises. And remember, in my second video, you will see me doing all of these. Seal slide, my little cute baby seal here. Lay on your tummy, push your hands up until your arms are straight and move across the floor while dragging your legs. Maybe you could see if you could figure that out before my next video. Bear walk. Walk on all fours like a bear, keeping your arms and legs fairly straight. My favorite, crab walk. Leaning backwards on all fours, hands and your feet, you're gonna walk around forwards and backwards. And some of you may remember what some of these have, are and what we've done in the past. Ooh, a penguin waddle. Keep your arms tight against the side of your body, then gently waddle side to side as you walk. Here's a bonus. Try and walk with a penguin egg on your feet. Take a small ball, a stuffed animal. Be creative, put something on the top of your feet and see if you can waddle without dropping that egg. A one-legged flamingo hops. I don't know if any of you have ever seen a flamingo, but stand on one leg, hop, and then land one-legged on the opposite leg. If too tricky, you could stay, sop, stay hopping on the same foot. Snake slither. I did a cartoon snake instead of the real snake. Lay on your tummy again and wiggle along the floor. It requires a lot of energy and strength to slither across the floor. Elephant walk. These are big animals. You're gonna put your arms together in front of your body and swing your homemade trunk from side to side as you walk. Don't forget to stomp your feet like your big elephant walks do. Donkey kicks. So we're gonna be safe with this one. So please remember, don't kick your feet all the way over your head. And if you're on a wood floor, let's try to put a towel or something underneath you. Start by getting on all fours, hands and feet, then simply kick your legs out and up. Fun challenge, stack some pillows or cardboard boxes and use your donkey kicks to kick them over. I know that you're excited to watch me do this. Another one, ooh, a duck waddle. Squat down low, tuck your hands into your armpits and you're gonna be making duck wings. Flap them around as you walk. A kangaroo jump. Keep your legs together, bend the knees a bit, and jump around as high as you can. Bonus, grab that stuffed animal again and hold it in front of you, pretend you have a kangaroo pouch. These animals are gonna be all reviewed again in my next video. Step three, to earn one quarter of the track, it equals 15 minutes. So here's my track. There's track one, there's a lap two, there's a lap three, there's a lap four, there's a lap five. So if you really did this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, that would get your 60 minutes every day. I know I only see you one day a week, but it's really good time to get up and get moving. Each of these little boxes or rectangles around the number is a quarter of the track. You're gonna now choose five animals. And if you don't like the five that you pick, you could definitely change them. You could do any pattern for the 15 minutes. So for example, maybe pick each animal that you choose. You're gonna do it for three minutes each. When you're done at the 15 minutes, you could take a break. You could set a timer and keep switching your animal until you get to the 15 minutes. Again, from those five that you picked. 
Here's the catch. There's always a Mrs. Sergeant catch. You must do this four times in one day to equal the 60 minutes. You don't have to do them all at once, but you want to do 60 minutes of activity all every day. It is so important. I'm hoping that you're all staying safe and being active, enjoying your time at home. Know that I miss you and everybody else misses you. And I can't wait to show you all my animal moves in my next video. See you soon.